guys and welcome back to Spot of Home Madrid. My name is Daniela. I'm showing you five beautiful bedrooms in a five bedroom apartment in Serrano. And as you're gonna be able to see, the apartment is beautifully decorated. The rooms are very spacious. We have high ceilings and we're also in a very nice part of Madrid. I really think you're gonna like it. Come with me. Okay guys, so we're standing by the front door, taking a look of the main living area. And as you can see, it's quite nice. We have pretty high ceilings. We have wooden walls. It's very nicely decorated. If we turn around this way, we have a nice comfy couch, a really nice, you know, tan couch with, you know, these plants right here. And we have this really nice uh, papering in the wall with this big mirror. So it's sort of like the main living area. If we turn around here, we have a dining table with four chairs, perfect for you and all your roommates. And if we turn, over here we have a TV that you can very comfortably see from the dining table or the couch. So that's really nice. If we look down, we see we have this coffee table done with a tire. It's real cute, real inventive. And if we look this way, we have sort of a, a partition wall here and we have the kitchen area. And as you can see, it's very nice. We have those wooden countertops, we have this granite dark um, countertops over there. Those were cabinets, okay. And we have a couple of windows here, really nice French windows, letting in some, you know, air and light. Over here we have some counter space, perfect for, you know, cutting up your veggies and preparing your meals. If you look over here, we have a dishwasher. We have a microwave. And over here we have the um, kitchen sink. And you know, you can put something here to like dry your plates. If we look over here, we have some cabinets for storage, you know, pantry space. Here we go. Some pantry space we have for plates, cups, everything. You have space for it over here. Let's open this up over here. And it goes all the way over there. If we look down, we have the washing machine over here. And then we have the electric stove top with four tops and the oven. And the windows go to an inner patio, so it's really quite quiet. Over here we have a big fridge. Let's see if we can open this. There we go. Right there. And we have one, the freezer over here, quite large. And on top of that, we have a smaller fridge over here. That way, no one's food would be left unrefrigerated. So that would be the kitchen area inside the main living area. Okay, let's start through here. Here we have the bathroom. This is bathroom number one, and it's larger than the, than the bathroom number two. We have this big shower right here with this glass partition and a removable shower head. It's quite large, the shower. If we turn around, we have the toilet, of course. We have some shelving over here for you to put your bathroom stuff. And over here, we have the bathroom sink. This really nice bowl with this big uh, base right here. This really nice base that goes really well with like the wooden uh, legs. And a lot of space here for your toiletries, your toothbrush, your makeup. Very nice for sharing with other people. And of course, we have a mirror over here so you can get ready and a window to the same interior patio over here. So if we keep moving, we reach bedroom number one. I believe this is one of the larger rooms. Uh, we have this big double bed over here with this nice headboard. If you look over here, we have that cute bear that I really like. And we have this, you know, uh, chest of drawers over here for your know, storage of your clothing or whatever you want to keep. Over here we have the closet, it's three door closet with a full length mirror included. And we have some shelving right here. And over here, if we open this, we have the rack and here another shelf. So plenty of storage. This with the chest of drawers does hold a lot. Let's check out the room from this side. Over there we have some shelving. And if we look over here, we have this very big desk large space with a TV over here and a chair for you to work. And this is one of the exterior views of the apartment. We have three exterior 
bedrooms. And of course, heating. Okay, let's check out the bedroom from here. Really nice. Continuing on, we have to go back to the main living area around this, and we get to bedroom number two. Quite spacious as well. I think it's slightly smaller than the other one, but it's pretty spacious as well. We have the double bed with the headboard. We have the chest of drawers, and we also have a desk, a smaller desk, but it's really, really nice with this glass desk with this shelf here, perfect for working on your laptop. And we have a little light right there. The view is pretty much the same as the, the room before, right there. And we have a very similar closet as well. We have three doors, shelving over here, full length mirror over there, and we have the rack and the shelf right there. Okay, moving on to bedroom number three. This one is pretty large as well. As you can see, we have an entire couch inside the room. A very large couch too, it looks pretty comfy. And if we turn around, we have the double bed with the headboard, and we have the same closet as well. Those, that's my bag, so please ignore them. And over here, we have the rack and the shelf. Over here, we have a desk, a nice white desk, which has little drawers over here. Chair, of course. But we have some storage in the desk. We have a mirror right here. You can use it as a vanity as well. And the, the view, again, quite similar because it's right next one to one another. So exterior views right here. Let's check out the bedroom from this side. Quite large. We have a shelf over there as well. Very lovely room. We continue on our trip. And now we're going to cross this living area. We have this nice table here. It's very similar to the desk in bedroom number two. We have a very large full-length mirror over here. And we arrive at the small hallway to bedroom number four. It's quite spacious as well as you can see. We have a lot of floor space. We have the big double bed with the headboard. We have a full-length mirror here as well. And again, the same closet. So we have shelving, the mirror, and the rack and shelf as well. It's important to note that you can also store things above the closets, like your bags, and that way you get to keep them out of the way. Here we have the shelving, and we have a very large desk right here, with your chair and your lamp. Now this, uh, a difference from the other ones, and it's an interior view. So as you can see the view here, let's see, maybe we can try to open this window. Not very good at opening windows, but I will try. See, I'm really bad at opening windows, but as you can see, it's a little view into an interior patio right there. And we have a clothesline right there. Yeah, no, I can't open this, okay. So let's check out the room from this side. Very nice, quite lovely. Okay, moving on. Let's check out the last bedroom, bedroom number five, which is this. This is slightly smaller than the rest of the bedrooms. I believe it's the smallest one, but it's still pretty comfortable in dimensions, as you can see. We're fitting here. I believe this is a, a single bed, but a very large one. Plasime, I think it is. And over here, we have the desk as well. We have a couple of chairs right there. Over here we have a chest of drawers, so you can see big drawers as well. And this area is actually the closet as well, like you can, we have a rack right there for you to hang clothes. And there's also this space right here for some storage. Well, right now we have some paint cans because we're, they're still painting the apartment, but we have some storage room there. And we also have cabinets right there. So your bags can definitely go away, your winter clothes when it's summer, and vice versa. And also something that I hadn't like pointed out, we have these really nice lamps right here, and the, which is nice with the really tall ceilings. And then, last but not least, we have bathroom number two. Slightly smaller than the other one, but still pretty, a uh, no, very complete bathroom. We have the toilet, of course. Over here we have the bathroom sink, the bowl with this really beautiful wooden base and this 
wooden framed mirror. And if we turn around, we have this shower with this um, shower curtain, this really pretty shower curtain. And it's a removable shower head that you can put right there to use as a regular shower. Pretty comfortable. And we walk right back to the main living room area to finish our tour. Well guys, that was it for today. I really hope you enjoyed it. See you next time. Bye.